Hello fellow survivors, it's your buddy RV Guy back again with another little quick video review. And today guys, um, I've got my pocket knife collection out, just cleaning it up. These are some of the knives that I've collected over the years. And the reason that I'm doing this, see I got the WD-40 here. The reason why I'm cleaning them out, make sure everything works and, you know, keep them oiled up nice and good, is because I'm going to be trying something different with the channel, guys. I'm going to be doing a pocket knife giveaway every Sunday, okay? It's gonna be it's gonna be called Pocket Knife Fun Day Sunday, where I'll be doing a giveaway. All right, now I'm gonna get into that, but before I get into that, I gotta give a shout out to Mr. Geraldine Collins eight two one. He's a subscriber, and he pointed something out to me. Now you remember we did this video on the uh, Jensen Bluetooth solar powered, uh, takes no battery solar powered radio. He pointed out to me that I didn't go over the Bluetooth connection aspect. Okay, well, I'm going to do that to you right now, guys. I'm going to do that for you, Mr. Collins. I'm going to go over that, and I apologize, and I appreciate you pointing that out to me. All right? So if you look right here on the radio, there's the power button. Turn the power button on, and uh, you'll get the blinking of the uh, speakers. Now, on the top here, there's a mode button. Whether you want to listen to... Let's see if we can get that. Right here, the mode button. You hit the mode button. It'll Very go to distinguished FM voice. radio. Uh, Burt passed away in 2018. He had a heart attack. And or it'll go to Bluetooth. You see the little Bluetooth blink in there? Now, the Bluetooth already has connected with my uh, my phone. Um, all you have to do is set your phone onto your Bluetooth. It's going to pop up on the screen, and you connect it, okay? Let's turn the speakers off. Let's turn the radio off. But yeah, that's how the Bluetooth works. This little mode button here. You hit it. Turn it back on for you. I'll show you real quick. You hit it. Hit the mode. There's a glimmer in their eyes. Once it gets on the Bluetooth, it's going to blink like that. When it stops blinking, it's connected. Now, I can't play anything on this because I use my phone to do the YouTube videos. But that's how you connect it. It'll search for your phone or whatever and it'll connect automatically it's not really a big deal but thank you mr geraldine collins for pointing it out to me i hope this helps you out if you're interested in getting this radio now let's get back to pocket knife fun day sunday guys okay Put the radio over here turn it off now these are some of the pocket knives like i said i've collected over the years guys um some of them are automatic, spring activated, or just regular pocket knives. Like this one here, it's got this nice little Chinese dragon on it. You hit it, and it comes out as a tack force. Okay, I guess the finger is to put in there for a stabbing mechanism, but it's got serrated edges on it. All right, and it's got it's double sided and it's got a blade. And like I said, I've been cleaning this up. They're kind of oily now, but oil is good. It'll keep them from rusting. There's a blue one with a blue dragon on it. All right, they all work, and they do have a uh, pummel at the end, a glass breaker, okay? All right, get some of this stuff off of here, cleaning these knives up. They also have belt clips on them, all right, glass breaker and belt clips. It's all different type of ones here. They're small little ones, all right? This one is a cursor blade. All right, I even got some uh, Victory Swiss Army ones here. All right, even got a Carabiner one here. It's got a saw, file, and a blade on it with a Carabiner. All you guys who like to put stuff on your backpacks. I've got one with a gut hook on it. Okay, I've got some Smith and Wessons. Um, Smith and Wesson. I've got some. All different type of ones, guys. All different type of ones that I've collected. And I'm going to be giving one away every Sunday until these are gone. And it'll be about three months, okay? Because I think I got almost three months of knives right here. And then there'll be other giveaways also as well. It's stuff that companies send me. But if you want to be involved in the uh, Fun Day Sunday pocket knife giveaway, the first one... Let's see, what are we going to do? What are we going to do here today? Uh, boom. First one will be the Green Dragon, all right? 
Green Dragon. If you want to be involved, if you want this knife, the first one that can tell me in the comment sections what's the difference between an epidemic and a pandemic will receive this knife in the mail. All right? The first one, the first one who can answer that question, what's the difference between an epidemic and a pandemic, gets this beautiful, I feel like the, uh, the knife guy on the, on the home shopping channel, right on cable, you get this beautiful TAC Force, TAC Force Speed, what is it, TAC Force, geez, they wouldn't hire me, TAC Force Speed Knife, all right, with the dragon on it, and then next week, maybe I'll do the blue one. For all these guys like the blue one. Now the green one, it's got a green dragon on it. It has Tac Force, Speedster model, collection series with a little flame here in the front. And you get a, uh, you can even wear it on your belt, guys. And it's got the pummel in the back, okay? Like slightly used, but great condition. All oiled up and ready to go, all right? The first one in the comment section who can tell me what's the difference between a pandemic and an epidemic gets this knife. Good luck, and thanks for being a part of the Extreme Dream Survival Channel.